Good afternoon and welcome. My name is Father Steve Connor of Holy Trinity Episcopal Church, and this is Wiley. And today is our Wednesday with Wiley. And so as we begin, <clears throat> let us remind ourselves of God's presence in our lives. The Lord be with you. Let us pray. Loving God, we ask you to send your blessings upon us this day as we move through the daily routines of this beautiful, sunny, warm, hot summer day. Continually remind us of your presence through the comfort of a breeze, through the beauty of a flowering bush, through the lovely waves on the ocean. And we ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Well, these really are the dog days of summer, aren't they? Wiley, we go out for our walk early in the morning about 6.30 and we run a little bit. But the walk isn't as vigorous in the heat, even though it's not that hot in the mornings. For Wiley it is. Isn't that right, buddy? Wiley? Wiley, I'm talking to you. No? Anyway, uh, so he comes home and he does one of two things. He immediately wants his treat for going out, which he gets. And then he eats his breakfast and then he just wants to sit, right? Or to lay down. Sometimes you just go up to the bedroom, don't you? And you get on the bed and you want to stay there all day, huh? because it's cool, right? And if he's not up on the bedroom, on the bed, then he's in the powder room on the tile floor, which is so nice and cool. These are the dog days of summer, those days when we slow down because it's hot, we don't move as fast, perhaps we put off doing that yard work or put off doing anything outside except relaxing, and that's okay. In the sense, that's what these summer days are for, to get us to slow down. And by slowing down, maybe perhaps taking a little bit of inventory of our lives, maybe thinking about how am I recognizing God's presence in my lives, how my life, how am I recognizing God's presence in those that I love? Slowing down, can help us to reflect, can kind of free our minds from the jumble of moving fast and getting things done to perhaps saying, it's okay to sit in a chair and to read. It's okay to sit in a chair and pray. It's okay to sit in a chair and meditate. These days of summer invite us to open our eyes again to the beauty of God that's all around us. You know, we go through our days, we have our routines, but summertime always seems to kind of, I don't know, jar us from that routine and invites us to slow down. So today I invite you to slow down invite you to think about how God is working in your life, to feel that cool breeze, to see that flowering bush, and to praise the God who walks beside us. Now Wiley here, Wiley, Wiley here may not like the heat, right? It's too hot. But he slows down as well. And when he slows down, Yes, you slow down, don't you? I've seen you slow down. Yeah. You don't run as far. He likes to put the leash in his mouth. I try to get it and we run. But he's only doing that now for about half a block instead of two blocks. So I invite you to slow down today. I invite you to see where God is working in your life. The Lord be with you. Let us pray. 
The power of your love seems too much for us. Your light unveils the secrets of our hearts. Can you wonder why we tremble? Yet you stand beside us as we walk through our fears to the path of wholeness and love, though our footsteps are unsure. You send the counselor as a guide to lead us on the road to peace, truth, and love. Amen. May God walk beside you today, today, and may God bless us all, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Amen. Okay, buddy, you going to say goodbye? No? Okay, you want to go back and lay down, don't you? Yeah. I think you're falling asleep in the chair. Are you? Okay. All right. God bless.